All right, what kind of cheesy nonsense can we get into? I'm gonna roll Thimble. Uh, five stats per level. All right, they should be fine. So Thimble's special abilities are con and defense are permanently set to one. All damage taken to health or armor is reduced to one. All healing reduced to one. Thumb size, enemies will not attack unless harmed. And thumb luck, 10% chance to avoid damage. 1% extra chance per dex, 50% max chance. I don't remember which one of these gets me the summoner, is my one concern. Um, shoot? I thought the uh, summoner class was, eh, dang. Is there, is there where I can check how to get the summoner? Nope. Uh, I can help remind if that's okay, absolutely. Cause I, I wanna go for a small summoner that doesn't fight and just uh, uses others' corpses to fight for me. I hope. Okay. Otherwise we can put the thimble off for a bit and be fireman. I just don't remember which one of these is fireman. I think it's this one. Yeah, do we want to just be Magnite Fire Fireboy? Yeah, let's let's just go for a Magnite Fireboy for the time being. We get tons of energy, and if I go with this, yeah, this this will be fine. This will be fine. We'll we'll do the thimble one in a bit once I've figured out which stats are what. Are homing missiles that seeks the nearest target or wink? Nope. Going with the homing missiles and do this. Right click. Okay, so that's wow. That's kind of shockingly huge. And does a lot of damage, too. All right. So I don't have too many. I'm probably going to focus on int for the time being. And what scales the heat wave damage? It doesn't actually say. Oh, wait. Enemies in contact take burn damage based on int. Nope, not that helpful. All right, so what does this man have? I mean, honestly, I might want to just get the cloak for a little bit of armor. Old book. Or there's the casting tunic. Int by 100% of defense, energy bolt. Or Book of Arcanum. Mm, or Wand? Uh, or Flame Staff. What does the Flame Staff do? I'm gonna grab the Flame Staff. Even if if it's not correct to remember his thoughts. Oh, I don't have a head slot. Eh, it's probably fine. Let's set things on fire. Whoa, dead rat. Dead rat that burned. And we don't care too much about crafting components, at least for a little bit. Question. Okay, cool. Okay, I'm burning a fair bit of energy here, but I think that's fine. Grab this, we get a top hat. Top hat, which is completely useless. That's a really good top hat. Shame I don't have a head. Uh, I'm just gonna invest an inch for the time being. Only have a head slot, you spicy Kirby. Oh, I mean, I have a head and a foot slot. Uh-oh. All right, top hat of swarm and binding. Whenever you take damage, a hostile rat appears. Cannot be removed. Charm per level increases charm. <laughs> oh, boy. All right. I love the description of me being a spicy Kirby. <laughs> right, let's grab the shield. I don't think it's going to be that helpful, but why not? All right, grab the scrolls. Oh, and some bread. All right, I am very slow. But that's fine. Dang. Unfortunately, getting this guy to actually not just clobber me is going to be tough. I don't do a whole lot of damage here. Is that beef jerky? Hopefully that's beef jerky. Grab the next of that. I guess we'll get one into teleport, which I'm like not going to use. And I'm just gonna invest a little bit into defense. I think we're gonna need it, just so I don't get absolutely drubbed here. Oh, and we want the green gems. Those are useful. All right, what else have we got in here? <laughs> Red just finally comes out of the, uh, or Rat comes out of the box and is just like, you. And then it just does not matter. Well, I really wish this did more damage. I mean, it sets enemies on fire, which is pretty big, but... Ow. Sir. Calm thine self and stop beating on me. Cripes. 
I'm actually in trouble here. Okay. That was incredibly close. We need to invest a little bit into health. And then eat bread. Wait, how do I heal? Because I just realized I have no food. Uh, do I... You have no diet, you do not eat. Do I have to invest in, in healing then? Like, pyro is the way to do it. But... Alright, pyro it is. This race is very strange. Okay, so we want Firebomb, which is huge. And we also want Pyromania C, because I can just set myself on fire for tons of big bonuses. Alright, cool. That should work. I just... Okay, Potion of Mana. Time Torn. Scroll of Paws. Whoa. Full Hemolet armor. Oh, but I have no armor. Damn it. Yeah, the problem is anything can hit me at this point, and I am a dead man if and when that happens. Okay, what is this? Unknown potion. I'm gonna just end up drinking a poison potion, and that's gonna be what does me in. I did get some booties. I did. Bone boots. It ain't much. Okay. Well, I'll just... Oh, wait. Do I heal on kill? Oh, right. You get EXP... Uh, you get EXP from heal... Um, from killing enemies. Okay, gem wand. Melee attack stores energy. Sure. It's also cursed! Ah! <laughs> Whenever you take damage, a hostile rat appears. <laughs> Spicy Necromancer Kirby or just Spicy Kirby? Currently just Spicy Kirby, however, I'm working my way up there. Uh, let's see. Let's just sell the Hemo Lead. We'll sell the bread and the jerky as, like, what else am I gonna do? Uh, unread scroll I might hold on to. Yeah, I don't think I can eat the slime. We could try, try buying a unknown potion and just hoping it doesn't kill me. Or just hope it doesn't kill me. Whee! Potion of Flames! Alright! That is not actually a problem. Got any rats? No. Alright. Nope! It just ran me over. Ah, too much damage. Not enough healing. Okay, so we might actually... Uh, we might want to figure out Roland Priest instead. So I think I'll roll Scholar first, and we'll give this we'll give this a go. I don't actually remember which one gets me what I'm looking for. All right. Uh, so I can't wear a cloak, so nothing nothing of that actually helps. I don't want to just grab like the Book of Arcana for the time being. Sure. Okay, so that's Scroll of Arrows. How do we how do we switch it? Oh, I can switch it. Magic missiles. Or magic deflections, maybe? I'm not actually sure which of these is going to be best. Alright. And I might as well invest in defense. Swap these. And wands or books? Oh, right. Take Wands now take energy from the air. Storing energy faster, no longer need food to recharge. Well, there's charms, melee, and ranged weapons that do not have... Oh, an int or energy scaling to be charged with energy. So that's actually more useful. So let's let's go for Wanda Expertise. Ah! Okay, so we also want to make... Get my Fire Nova as the right. 
I don't know if this gets any bigger. Why is this book bad? Okay, let's just set him on fire from afar. There we go. At least that heals me a smidge. We can do that. We level up a bit. I'm just going to keep investing in int. And work around. We, what do we get? Ooh. Void Staff. Probably better than this. Void Staff does. Pulls in enemies, draining their energy and silencing them. Alright. Works for me. I think it needs a target. Oh, that could be it. Right, let's just set some things generally on fire. I wish this was just a little better. Okay. I'm just gonna ring around the rosy with this guy. Oh. Misfire. It's fine. You can't touch me. I've mastered the art of going in circles around impediments. And it will that will be what keeps me safe and sane. Oh, there was there was a creature there. Huh, yeah, I can even pull in the, uh, I can even pull in the chests. Wild. Can locked doors be destroyed? Not to my knowledge, no. Okay, so we want to grab the next level of wand expertise and then staff expertise. And then I'm going to invest in constitution while we're here. We have some spiked boots, which are pretty bad, but, I mean, why not? We'll go with this. There we go. Pretty sure I can't eat slime. Or bread. Okay, now I do more damage. I haven't leveled up yet. Alright, there we go. And thank you, Omega Zero, for the 49 month resub. Cripes! That is a time and a half. Okay, so this whole magic magic arrows thing is actually working really well for me. I should have kept that in mind. Oh, well, it's fine. So what do we have? Shiner, Art, Artificer, Scribe, Necromancer, Summoner, or Healer? Um, I'm actually... We're going to start with Healer, seeing as I can't heal myself normally. Because otherwise I'm in trouble. Uh, let's see. So Cure, Regenerate, or... That's the last one. Malpractice. Consumes energy and in, into heal a living enemy for 10% of the constitution per energy spent. Then they start losing 10% of your constitution per energy spent over time. Wait. What? Oh, okay. Buff persists after regeneration is complete, but regenerates four times slower. So do I want to grab an instant cure, or do I want to grab regeneration and malpractice? Because regeneration is just a slow heal over time uh, that I could actually just have going at all times. And malpractice hurts enemies, all nearby enemies, for energy based on int. To heal a living enemy for 10% of their constitution per energy spent, then they start losing 10% of your con. Uh, malpractice level 3 doesn't work? Ah, That's a shame. Well, we're going to start with regen, because that's going to be what saves me a little bit. Let's grab this. I just... I love the idea of a damage over time AoE. I guess I could get one point in regeneration, three points in heal, and two points in malpractice. Because the regen level two isn't that great, because I'm not going for all allies. And, I mean the full regen, otherwise I could just put one point into cure. Because I still feel like two points into malpractice might be kind of fun. So it's really busted when level three works. 
Huh, it lowers, oh. Max HP. We also have, ooh, a sturdy merchant's hat. I'm just gonna grab that. That's gonna be really helpful for later. For now, not that amazing. Okay, good. The regen's gonna keep me up. I was very worried about that for a brief second that I was going to be functionally healthless as far as this run goes, but we're fine. I can just keep setting these on fire. Set the rat on fire. Let's switch the book back. Okay, I guess I might as well put the merchant hat on just because unfortunately it doesn't actually reflect on my character model. I'd really love to see this stupid ass like burn Kirby creature. There we go. Oh no, 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 no. Damn it. I did not realize I was close enough to that golem to wake it up. Well, it's okay. It The golem suffers from... a lack of overall wisdom here. I'm just gonna... I guess I'm just gonna shoot it here. Oh, I've switched to the bouncy orbs, which is also good. All right, that actually, that worked a thousand times better than I was expecting it would. And we now have a rot wand. Enemies damage gain is slow. Okay. Let's grab that over that. Tabby. Eh, dex and movement speed, not that amazing. And a bunch of things that I should probably just sell. Uh, let's grab Malpractice and also put it on right click. I am just here to cause chaos. And damn, okay. I need a rusty... I need a rusty key. Let's go let's go buy one of them, assuming I can afford it. Um okay. So 10% of your constitution per energy spent over time. So in this case, we actually want a lot of constitution. Sell the mage armor. What about the iron mask? Nah. Simple charm. I don't have any charm slots. I mean I kinda do, but trash removal, get out of here. What about the cute wand? Healing done is doubled, which is kind of good. We don't need the tabby, we don't need the clothes. The void staff is okay. Is it constitution mage time? No, we're probably going to want to invest in intelligence if I want to do the uh, the big blast. Oh, in your inventory if you place a torch below a burnable item it will catch fire. Yeah, I kind of saw that earlier. Okay, sell the slime. I'm pretty sure I can't eat the honey. Holy moly, honey is worth surprisingly large amounts of money. I was not expecting that. Oh well. Okay. Well, this is a weird build and not one that I intended. However, I now do a lot of damage and I'm not quite sure why. I think that smell practice, just absolutely shredding them. Or it's healing them. I'm I'm not sure. It seems like he heals. Yeah, it seems like he might be healing a little bit based on the malpractice hit, which is a little confusing. Oh, right, of course. That's how malpractice works. It heals them first, and then they just take, presumably, take some damage. I think just the big issue is his constitution is higher than mine. And there's only so much I can do about it. All 
Okay, so I'm just gonna go back to setting them on fire. Because he's very slow and can't seem to deal with this. It seems like we might just need more constitution. Yeah, that's where I'm at. Well, luckily he has a critical case of the cannot function around <laughs> pillars. <laughs> oh right, I forgot. Did we do like stupid contact damage? I forgot about that little fact. Right, let's go back to setting him and his body on fire and we're good. Come on. I know if you destroy a body, you get its loot. I'm just gonna... It's gonna take a bit. There we go. What did he drop? A bow, mask, armor, and eh, nothing terribly exciting. Unfortunately, going to the castle right now is just generally bad moves. Ooh. But possibly worth it all the same. Okay. You've got charge attacks. Yeah, I can't get through his armor, but I can... I can just murk him with fire. This is really silly. And yet, it works! Is this gonna have me level? No. But at least I can keep looting these guys for all they're worth. There's a silver key in the other room, which is why I want to go this way. These doors are very flammable, yet they have yet to... They have yet to burn. Do I want to... F Ooh. Yeah. Has the energy cost of incantations and staves. Oh, perfect. I can just beat the body. Yes. All right. Uh, we got some paper. We can get rid of that. I'm going to quaff a random potion. Potion of mana. Heal. Okay, uh, let's go back and sell, because I don't think we need any of these. Sadly, I don't think the merchant staff actually improves my healing abilities. Why am I exploding forwards? I have no idea. Oops. Actually, are these tabby... These tabby might be better. Yeah. These tabby at least are better. What about the rest of these? I don't think any of them have cool effects. Well, time to just sell everything. I'll probably get rid of the cute ones. The extra healing would be nice, but maybe not terribly necessary. Okay, Book of Arcana. Yeah, we don't need it anymore. Decent chunks of money, and onwards. Scroll of Magic Missiles. Eh, it's fine. Okay. Let's go get that silver key. There, there was another guy. Oh yeah, there is another guy here. Okay, this is working way better than it ought to. Is that a rat that I killed? It might have been a rat. Now let's just get the next level of malpractice. Affects near all nearby enemies. Cool. Whoa. Whatever that is. Th this person is a little bit better geared than I am. But it didn't matter. It did not save them. Hello, sirs. What if these arrows of yours are? They're terrifying. And yet... Gonna set corpse on fire. Beat corpses until it gives loot. What about this body? Come on. There we go. These people are loaded. 
leeching swords. Whoa, these are cool. Not useful for me at the moment, but cool. All right, I think the rest of this is all trash. Yeah. All right, well, all things considered, time to just invest hard into regeneration. I don't know. I think we might actually want to just get the uh, rank three of regen regenerate and skip the heal. Cure is nice, but almost better to just have uh, permanent slow heal with a burst that I can trigger. Ooh. Defense by 30%, charm by 50%. Nah. Well, tempting. We're not really going for a charm build. At least not yet. Oh, yeah, even a leeching knife. Boy, there's so many different types of equipment I've never even seen it in this game. It's neat. I just... I think of all the opportunities. Okay, so... Can I get here? Maybe. Because what I want to do is piss these guys off without opening that door. Come on. Oh, there's one. Alright. Owie. Owie. Boy, this guy is laughably slow. Here's the thing, though. I can just kind of hug him to death. Oh, come on. Come back, sir. Come back. I just want to burn you. Well, all right, fine. I don't want to spend forever waiting for these people to become available for me. Nor do I want to go to the castle because that's usually certain death at this stage of the game. I've obviously developed some kind of wonked out super build already. I'm not even really sure where all that bonus damage is coming from. I'm, I'm pretty sure it's a result of this. Enemies in contact take burn damage based on energy, so I should probably invest a little bit more into energy. Like, I am now the one that does the contact damage. Oh, I don't have a key. You know what? I don't really need a key. If I can just kill things on the other side of a wall, that's really all I need. Okay. Go for that. Yeah, my, ener my energy is just growing on its own. So I'll just call it close enough. Uh, it's... I'm going to go for it anyway, even if it doesn't actually work. Just in the off chance it somehow does work. But also, just so I don't have a healing spell on top of every everything else. Is there a rat in here? There was. But no longer. Please give more rat. Must burn rat. What you need to do is just hug and run circles around them. I mean, if I just invest hard into constitution, I could potentially kind of do that. Just have so much HP that uh, everything dies based purely on proximity and nothing more. Okay, anything else? Nope, down we go. Hug the fluffy rats. Hug everything with fire. And we might even get rid of, like, or get rid of, just stop attacking. Uh, do we want a silver key? Yeah, kind of expensive, but I'm going to grab it anyway. Uh, do I go for the sewers? I don't really want to go to the sewers. We want to go to the ice territories. They're usually the ones with all the good stuff. Okay, grab the potions. Now, do I see another key out here? I'm here to hog. There we go. Let's just go this way. I don't see any rusted, rusted keys along the way. Excuse me. You cannot touch me. I mean, you can, but it's considered rude. Let's see, go for the Concaster class next wander. If that's available? I thought that was like specific to a race, but I could be wrong. Ooh, this guy's got explosives and a crab. It didn't save him though. There we go. Anything else around here? And yeah, these doors do not 
Eh, none of this matters. Down we go. Blood weavers can be of any race. Oh, good to know. Okay, I'm just gonna pop the regen and just kind of let it go. Hopefully it just stays active. And if it doesn't, oh well, I'll live. All right, do we have anything else? I already have another silver key. Hey, and here's the ice caves. Ice caves are great because they usually have more enemies. Okay. There we go. This is working kind of too well. And yeah, just keep investing in that. Okay, so is the blood... No, it doesn't look like I have the blood caster available yet. How do you unlock it? Uh, let's see. Drain any energy from nearby ally or nearby enemies based on int. Uh, can consume ghosts. Afterlife. Everything around you is subjected subjected to undeath. Living creatures that die around you are raised as allied corpses. Corpses and whites that die around you are raised as allied skeletons. Skeletons that die around you come back as ghosts. You transform into a lich. And also imbue soul as a ghost possess an ally. Huh. Maybe. So it could go that direction. Shiner is kind of fine, but not amazing. This is based on how high your constitution was. Okay. I thought it was just like higher than 10 or something. Just kind of easy to get. Do you get EXP specifically off of uh, summoning? Probably not. Because yeah, we could we could just go full full necro. trying to think of what other things would help me because bard isn't that helpful caster might get me somewhere and shield master is virtually pointless the only other thing that i think would be really helpful actually would be uh getting merchant just to reduce the cost of things but let's go necro i if blood mage shows up we'll switch to blood mage ish Okay, so imbue corpse. Imbues nearby corpses from defeated enemies with a thousand ints animating them to life. They will be hostile to everyone, including the caster. Corpses may become dominated upon animation. This incantation now gives a buff that animates nearby allies on death, including the caster, which is interesting. Corpse is a weird class you can gain. What? Okay, well, I, mm, I think I'm just gonna go with imbue corpse to start with. Looks like I've got a lot, but I might as well grab this one so I can just summon some more people. And we will just make it number three. Well, oh. I've identified a scroll of imbued corpse. I didn't know there was something I could do. Okay, I have got slow down. Oh my gosh, I am just going to be here for a while, aren't I? Oh, I can just explode myself next to enemies. <laughs> well, that's one way to do it. It's, we're going to be here for a while. Hello. I am here now. Full contact fireman. I don't even know what to describe myself as. Anyway, let's summon some friends. Hello, friends. Are you worth EXP? Can I double farm you? No, it doesn't look like it. I was really hoping I could double farm enemies for EXP. Alas, that does not seem to be the case here. 
On the plus side, I do horrid things to anybody that I can finally reach and hug and then heal. Oh, you know what? I probably have enough uh, HP that we can start using Malpractice. I'm just going to set the rat on fire. And while we're here, excuse me, sir. Oh, yeah, Malpractice does horrendous things to folks now. Come on, get closer. No, come back. Come back. Come back, sir. No. Just need a little bit more range. Wait, what if... What if imbue corpse? Yes. It's confused. Ah, uh, it needs to just be a little larger, but I don't think I can increase the, the size of it. Much to my eternal sadness. You killed my Zamboni. Please just get closer to me. I'm lonely. No. Boy, look at all these dudes here. If only I could hit them through that wall. Oh, there even was a spare key that I could have used. Oh, but I couldn't have gotten there anyway due to the door switching thing. It's fine. It's fine. Where's the exit? It's over here. Heard of a few secret classes that you have to find the right combination of requirements, but I've never seen one. I saw the Bloodcaster just very briefly a long time ago. And then that was pretty much it. Sell the Magus robes. Don't need that. And Book of Omens. Oh, it's it's for undead stuff. Got it. Bloodweaver comes from Rays. Bloodfallen, Scholar, Bloodweaver. I thought so. Okay, whatever you are is kind of tough. I think my best bet is just to wiggle on this man. Oh right, I can hit him with a wand. It's not great, but still. Keep exploding. I might want to switch the fire wand out. As fun as it is to keep exploding in this manner. Uh, maybe not the most practical. Summon undead. Who cares if it turns out that they're hostile to me? You're not a threat to me. I already killed you once. Hey, and thank you, Acme Boy, for the 44 month resub. Let's just beat this corpse. I don't know if there's anything terribly practical that I can grab from it that I'd actually care to have. There we go. Why is this build so good? I mean, I kind of get it. It just feels imp uh, improbably strong. Okay, let's keep healing up because regen is great. Keep grabbing this. Now gives a buff that animates nearby allies on death. Cool. Domination failed. Fight! Fight for my amusement, Zambonis. And I'm gonna be over here fighting this guy. Now is the crab friend or foe? It is it is foe. Archer boy was friend, I guess. Not that there's a whole lot of distinction between anyone. Let's keep investing in constitution. Okay, what does he have? He does have a holy wand, which I think we want. I'm gonna grab that. The flame wand is kind of fun, just kind of exploding, but eh. Reduce cooldowns? Nah. I'm happy with where I am. So this will make it so I heal even harder. There we go. Perfect. Okay, we level up again. I'm just I'm just gonna keep investing in constitution. 
Do we want to explode corpse? Compared to dominate? Nah. Domination ain't a thing I'm doing. Let's just explode corpses. We might have too many things on the right right click. Oh well. You cannot run from me. You may think you can run from me, but that's a terrible terrible plan. Actually, this sh this sucker hurts. Like really bad. Uh. Wow. Okay. <laughs> he was not expecting that. <laughs> Dude just turns the corner and just gets a firm drubbing. Uh, let's grab that weird sword. Grab this. Grab some of these. Hello, foes. Okay, so medical malpractice is... I think this crab actually just has way more constitution than I do. It's fine. I can run rampant over him. He's just very tough. Okay, and then this guy is not nearly as tough. I, ooh, but he hurts. He hurts for big dangage. Okay, well, luckily my Zamboni friends are fairly good. Oh, and they're both friendly. Alright, that's actually kind of a relief. I realize both of those guys that I just raised are a fair bit tougher. Oh, and there's a rat. And it exploded. Hi. Huh. Might actually be able to give him equipment. It's not something I was expecting, but thank you, Crab Man. A little bit of that. Beat them all up. Domination failed. It's fine. Now, do I only get one minion at a time? Maybe. Okay, what do we have? Potions that I'm just going to start quaffing. Acid, healing, flames. Fine. Get rid of some of this garbage. Namely that garbage. Oh, and I am very slow. Anything else? Eh, not really. Wow. Alright, get him, crab boy. Ow. So I'm definitely digging Necromancer better than the Succubus. Succubus denied me EXP. Oh, and yeah, I, I am currently silenced. Luckily, that is not, not my main means of combat. Do you have anything else here? No, not really. Okay, looks like the crab's following me again. Alright. So, gold key? No. Healing staff. Heals con damage. Fireball staff. Launches a fire... fireball. I mean... Tempting. Let's just kind of sell whatever, because I don't think any of these are really going to help me too much. Outlaw's Hood. I don't think I've seen that one before. Okay, Flame Wand. Amusing, but not that great. Uh, let's see. Slippers. These. Toss these. So do I want to grab the Fireball Staff or the Healing Staff?
because the fireball could be useful. The healing staff keeps me alive. Let's just stay alive. Especially because heals con damage might be kind of handy. Oh, where'd my crab go? Did I delete crab? I might have gotten rid of my crab. Oh, well. More in constitution. And... More in corpse explosions. Cool. Oh. It was supposed to go the other way. Oh, well. Huh. Lacking energy. I guess we should invest in the caster class so I can actually get the, uh, start investing into the, some of the other moves. Why is practice actually just not that helpful? Why are these elves so dodgy? Come back here. Uh, crabs. I'm just gonna drub them to death. What else am I going to be able to do? They just roll away. Come back. Have I unlocked the slime yet? Oh, there we go. That's the solution. All I need to do is just explode them. Okay. Ooh, boy. There we go. That was some doing. Alright, exploded corpses no longer become skeletons upon being exploded would rather lose 50% of the max health. This would destroy them then they become skeletons. That sounds about right. Yeah, have I unlocked the slime yet? Yes. I haven't used it, though. Or, I, I should have enough tokens that I can unlock it. I guess is the real answer. Wow, that whole corpse explosion thing gets really silly. Toss the torches, because we certainly do not need those. And then we have whatever you are. Big sucker. The drubbings will continue until you are quite dead, sir. I don't do that much damage, but it doesn't matter. Oh, crab ran out of energy. That's why it went away. Got it. Any enemies you damage become poisoned for 10% of the damage. Oh. Okay, we might actually want the excellent poison wand. It's also the rose staff. But no, let's grab the poison wand. Just wands akimbo. It's just keep dealing with the ice area. Woo! Okay. Yeah, that seems like it's the better idea. Hello, fools. Do you want to mine? I don't think it is. There we go. Doesn't matter. Alright, pick up a new class. So... We have two options here. Okay, you don't need Blood Fallen as I got a Human Bard set up. So Blood Weaver, Scholar. Wait, didn't I start a Scholar? I did. Let's see if it's available yet. No, I'm not seeing any Blood Weaver. Well, hopefully it'll show up before the end of this run because this very much feels like it. Imbue Skeleton. Skeleton or Corpse of Skeleton with energy, animating it. Uh, so I can make them allied to caster. Or, Rip Bone. Rips a bone from an enemy Corpse of Skeleton permanently reduces target's defense by 25%. Bone blocks damage based on the target's defense. Can only be ripped from targets that have skeletons and more than zero defense. Upon breaking, bone part... Whoa, I love that. That's really good. Tear apart nearby corpses to get bones. If it has a skeleton. I don't know, like, I don't really care about, uh... I don't really care about raising the dead for the most part. 
I do like the idea of everything just exploding. So, let's just go Rip Bone or Calcium Collector. Oh wait, maybe this isn't as useful as I think it is. Okay, so I guess I guess we should imbue. Let's do Rip Bone and imbue Skeleton, because Calcium Collector seems really interesting, but maybe not that great. Okay, so let's go Necro, and let's start with imbue Skeleton. I'm gonna oh, imbue Corpse is fine. Uh, frankly, I'm just gonna right click. I guess we should start investing a little bit into intelligence. My HP is pretty good. Maybe I should turn off Corpse Explosion. I don't know if I got any skeletons out of that. We might have just destroyed them. Maybe there just were no skeletons to be had. Okay, well. So we got Mage Armor, Rot Wand, nah. Sell all of these. This is a cool looking Hyper Hammer. Melee attack. Damage uses energy to do extra damage. Ah. It's also terrible. We're just gonna skip that. Wait, what did I spend all my money on? Probably this hat. Uh, let's go out this way anyway. I'm not gonna get anything out of that and prep for some sick music. Uh, ooh, gold key. Please tell me I have silver key. Yes, I do. Pop that open, but we're going this way. Aha! You may explode me and set me on fire, but it will not save you. Okay. I might, I might, I think I'm actually dead here. I can do just a smidge. Oh, please die. Oh my god, that got hairy. I need some better ranged attacks. Yeah, because the thing is, this guy doesn't actually do damage to me. Okay, nope, I dead. I'm dead. Now you have the corpse class. Unfortunately, this stinking dude is brutal. Um, and yeah, maybe next time Necro and Summoning? Yeah, maybe. I, sure. Let's try Thimble. 